There's something magical about twins that captures our imagination, from their unique connection to each other to the uncanny coincidences that seem to happen in their lives. But some twins are even more special than others, with extraordinary features that will leave you in awe. Get ready to double the fun and the surprise as we look at 10 rare black twins that are one in a million. Number 10. Xavier and Zakari Johnson Xavier and Zakari Johnson were born on February 11, 2018. Xavier has oculocutaneous albinism, a type of albinism affecting 1 in 20,000 people worldwide. This condition affects pigmentation in the skin, hair, and iris of the eyes, resulting in fair skin and white or golden blonde hair. If both parents carry the faulty gene, there is 1 in 4 chance their child will be born with the condition. However, because the twins are non-identical, only one of the two children could inherit the gene from their parents and develop the albinism. It's been difficult for many to believe that Zakari and Xavier are related, as Zakari is black like his parents, while Xavier was born with albinism and has snow white skin and golden hair. Dorian, Xavier's mother, often faces hurtful comments from strangers who assume that her African American son must be adopted because of his brother's appearance. She's speaking out about the everyday racism she and her son face, hoping to raise awareness and end discrimination against children with albinism. When Dorian and her sons are out in public, people often treat them differently and ask if Xavier is hers. This hurts her as a mother, and she sees it as a negative reaction. Based solely on her son's skin color, Dorian gets offensive about it because she believes it's a form of discrimination, and she wants people to recognize that her sons are twins despite their physical differences. Despite her initial fear of Xavier being bullied, Dorian is proud to be a mom of her rare and unique boys. She wants them to have a normal life and not let albinism get in the way. Number 9. Megan and Morgan Boyd Next is the captivating True Blue Twins. These American social media stars burst onto the scene in 2015 when their mother shared a photo of them on Instagram. What made them so unique and special? Their striking and rare eyes, of course. From their birth, Megan and Morgan Boyd stood out from the crowd, captivating everyone with their unique eyes. One twin boasted a pair of stunning blue eyes, while the other had one blue and one dark brown eye. Their rare and mesmerizing features quickly made them famous on social media, stealing the hearts of countless online users. But before they were internet sensations, they were already well known in their community as the True Blue Twins. Born to proud parents Stephanie Boyd and Lovell Knight in Philadelphia in 2011, the girls were an instant hit with everyone they met. Their mother loved sharing their daily adventures on social media, and the online community quickly grew as more and more people fell in love with the adorable duo. But what makes the True Blue Twins' eyes so unique? It's all in their genes. Their mother and grandfather have stunning blue eyes, while their uncle and great grand aunt have one blue and one brown eye. No wonder these two girls are such a rare and beautiful sight. You may want to join the millions of fans following the True Blue Twins to see their incredible journey as they continue to capture the world's attention with their infectious smiles, sparkling eyes, and boundless energy. Number 8. Lucy and Maria Aylmer You will also be amazed by the story of Lucy and Maria Aylmer, the biracial twins who stunned the world with their strikingly different appearances. Born in 1997 in Gloucester, UK, to a half-Jamaican mother and white father, the Aylmer Elmer's sisters are as different as night and day. One has straight ginger hair, a fair complexion, and deep blue eyes, while the other has masses of curls and far darker skin, and her eyes are a sparkling brown. Despite being twins, their appearances are so contrasting that it's hard to believe that they are sisters, let alone twins. Their mother, Donna, was shocked when she saw them for the first time, as skin color doesn't appear on scans before birth. Their other siblings have skin tones that are somewhere between Maria and Lucy. The Elmer twins are non-identical and inherit different genes from separate eggs. Donna carries genes for both white and black skin, and by chance, Lucy inherited genes for white skin, while Maria inherited genes that code for black skin. Their unusual appearance made people question whether they were twins, and even their friends demanded to see their birth certificates. Despite their differences, the sisters are incredibly close and were even in the same class at school, although no one had trouble telling them apart. Number 7. Isabella and Gabriella Shipley Isabella and Gabriella are two adorable twin girls who have already taken the inner Internet by storm at seven months old. What makes these sisters so unique is their vastly different skin tones. Despite being African American, proud mother Clementina Shipley describes her bundles of joy. Isabella is calm and laid back, giggling and ticklish, while Gabriella is a smiling ball of energy who started crawling at just five months old and hasn't stopped moving since. Although many have assumed the girls to be mixed race, their blackness is celebrated.
celebrated through their distinct skin tones, representing the diverse beauty within the black community. Despite facing trolls on their Instagram page, little strong girls who criticize the girls' differences, Shipley and her husband prioritize their daughter's comfort in their skin and embrace the positive responses to their unique sisterhood with their beautiful big eyes and precious baby curls. It's hard not to catch the fever. But the other part of their sisterhood is how they represent the beauty of blackness. They may look like spitting images of each other, but the obvious difference is each baby's beautiful shade of skin. Number six, Lara and Mara Bawar. Lara and Mara are the dynamic twins breaking barriers and redefining beauty on the catwalk. Born and raised in Sao Paulo, Brazil, these tenacious twins have already made waves in the fashion industry with their mesmerizing looks. Their parents are of West African descent, and Lara and Mara rose to fame back in 2016 when Swiss photographer Venetius Terranova captured them alongside their older sister, Sheila, who is also a model, for a personal project called Rare Flowers. The enchanting concept highlighted the beauty of diversity through the sisters' contrasting complexions, and it quickly went viral on the internet. Since then, the Bawar sisters have become Instagram sensations and have worked with top fashion brands like Nike, Insanis, and Bazaar Kids. They are proud of their albinism and believe it adds to their uniqueness and beauty. We feel albinism is pretty. We love our hair, eye color, and skin tone. Growing up like this was amazing. We love being different and are happy with our unique beauty, they say. Their expressive and creative personalities shine through in their modeling work and have captured the hearts of many with their captivating look, with a long list of fashion's biggest names under their belt. Lara and Mara are definitely ones to watch. If you're enjoying this video so far, please leave a like on it. It goes a long way in helping get our message out to more people. We aren't just telling stories, we're changing lives and waking our culture up. Number five, Gia Sarnicola and Zuri Copeland. This is a heartwarming story about two young girls, Gia Sarnicola and Zuri Copeland, who believe that they are twins despite not being related by blood. They base this belief on their close bond and similarities, such as having exactly the same birthday and wanting to dress alike. The girls' moms, Ashley and Valencia, support their belief, but also recognize the challenges they may face as they grow older and society tries to impose its norms on them. The story highlights a powerful message about the importance of seeing beyond physical appearances and embracing the idea that we are all connected at a deeper level. Gia's response to the older child who questioned their twinship, we're twins because we share the same soul, is a poignant reminder of this message. Despite the challenges they may face, Gia and Zuri remain as close as ever and continue to inspire others with their bond. As Valencia notes, we can learn a lot from children like Gia and Zuri. Their message to push back against cynicism and focus on what's important is a valuable one. Number four, Ruth and Kitty Lajess. Ruth and Kitty Lajess are the twin models taking the fashion industry by storm. Unlike traditional models who simply showcase fashion, Ruth and Kitty have pushed their profession to new limits by creatively using their God-given physical features to their advantage. Their latest photo shoot might even fool you into thinking they're conjoined twins. In a series of stunning photos posted by Ruth, the twins can be seen dressed in identical outfits, with one twin standing behind the other in a way that makes it look like they share the same body. But upon closer inspection, you'll see it's just an optical illusion created by their expert posing and talented photographer. The attention to detail in their poses and wardrobe is so precise that you might wonder if they're two people or just one. This level of creativity and attention to detail has made Ruth and Kitty stand out in the fashion industry and gain a huge following. So the next time you see them, don't be fooled by their identical looks. These twins are two unique individuals who know how to work it in front of the camera. Number three, Cohen and Tuin Stewart. One reason why twins might not look alike is that they have different fathers. This can happen to fraternal twins when a woman's eggs are fertilized by sperm from different men at different times. It's called super fecundation or heteropaternal super fecundation. Paternity testing can reveal who the biological fathers are. Sometimes, fertility treatments can cause super fecundation too. For example, Cohen and Tuin Stewart, who are twins from the Netherlands, were born through IVF in the lab. There was a mix-up where equipment was used twice and another man's sperm was mixed with the father's. DNA tests confirmed that the biological father of one twin was Mr. Stewart, while the other was a black man from Aruba. Under Dutch law, the Stewarts were deemed the parents of both boys, and the black man did not make any legal claim to see his son. According to the National Human Geome Research Institute, not all twins look identical due to two different types of twins, monozygotic and dizygotic. Monozygotic twins are also known as identical twins, which means they originate from the same embryo. This embryo divides after fertilization, resulting in twins with 100% identical genes because they come from the same DNA. Number two, Marsha and Millie Biggs. At first glance, 11-year-olds Marsha and Millie Biggs look nothing alike. Marsha has blonde hair, blue eyes, and pale skin. 
while Millie has black curly hair, brown eyes, and brown skin. Strangers who meet the girls often assume they're best friends, not twin sisters. The girls' parents, Amanda Franklin and Michael Biggs, of white and Jamaican descent, respectively, say they've always accepted their daughters, but have had to deal with curious questions from strangers. The parents recall people's surprise when they first saw the girls together. Are they twins? Yes. But one's white and one's black? Yes. It's genes. In National Geographic's April issue, which focuses on race, the girls share their stories, noting that they've never experienced racism. However, they are aware of what it is. Millie explains that racism is when someone judges you by your skin color and not by who you really are. She adds, it's better to be you. You don't always have to blend in the crowd, because if you do, you don't get noticed. While the girls may look different outside, they're like any other sisters, close and protective of each other. Number 1. June and Jennifer Gibbons June and Jennifer Gibbons were twin sisters born in 1963 in Yemen. Their parents, Gloria and Aubrey Gibbons, moved the family to the United Kingdom shortly after. The twins were inseparable and spoke their own unique language, which was hard for others to understand. When they started school, the other children often bullied them, which made the twins even more reserved. They only spoke to each other and their younger sister, Rosie. The twins refused to read or write and were sent to see therapists, but wouldn't talk to anyone else. June and Jennifer were sent to several therapists who tried unsuccessfully to get them to communicate with others. In a desperate attempt to break their isolation, the pair was even sent to separate boarding schools, but became catatonic and withdrawn when parted. When they finally saw each other again, the twins spent a lot of time in their room playing with dolls and creating stories. They made different stories like they were making a TV show. Sometimes, they would read the stories to their sister Rose. They got a special gift for Christmas, which helped them to start writing. They started taking a class in writing and wrote many different stories, poems, and books. The stories they wrote were mostly about young people doing bad and dangerous things, all of which took place in California. Thanks for watching today's video. If you enjoyed this, then you'll love the video on the screen. It's an incredible story that will change your perspective on life. Click on it right now. We'll see you over there.